Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Surviving Alpha 18. So I did a few things last night. I started trying to knock these out. These blocks have got 10,000 hit points each and then there's a 5,000 bl uh, block of reinforced concrete behind them. So I'll probably knock out one block a night until they're gone. Uh, I'm assuming that these are going to be the same. A real pain in the behind, uh, but we'll eventually get them out of here. Uh, I set up another forge. I want to use this forge to be melting all of our brass and um, our lead for making ammunition and stuff. And we're going to get this going around the clock at some point too, but for now we're just going to leave it. Uh, I did make a little bit more uh, gunpowder last night, like 200 and something. So we've got a bit of gunpowder here, not a lot, but we got 420. I got everything moved over into here. So this is just all our stuff to make stuff with. I want to hang on to the empty cans because we need them to make oil with. Uh, so I'm going to do that. Leave that there. we got a lot more concrete running here. Uh, let's just pull this out and get it going in here. And we've got plenty of concrete here. we got enough to hit up 200 blocks. So we've got our, our sort of... Uh, task ahead of us today so I want to get down get right into working on the base today um, I don't want to mess around let's leave this up so we are planning on right so this is gonna be I removed all of these now it goes to right there I believe so let's get this all filled in and built up Now, we might get a screamer today. I didn't get one last night. Which is weird. I had like two forges going, plus the chem station, and nothing. So I kind of got lucky. Not that it matters. I mean, screamers go down pretty quick. As long as they don't see you. And if we can get this up three high, then we shouldn't have to worry about anybody they summon in either. By the time they see us up here. If they do, they might come around to the front of the building. Now the big thing we do need to do is get some steel. I think I'm going to use our money to buy steel because we do have to get steel reinforced doors. So he had like 50 something steel. So I think I might just go buy all that today or tomorrow. Uh, actually today, because today will be the last day before he restocks. So we'll have to shoot over there later on today. Pick that up. So there's another skill point. We, we had one from yesterday, and I used that for light armor. Uh, just because it gives us better like better mobility in light armor. It gives us 15% more mobility. Alright, so that's almost half of our uh, concrete gone already. Uh, but nobody can complain about me not making my base as sturdy enough. I'm always paranoid if I don't make a strong platform. That they're just going to like get underneath me and start beating on stuff. And then it's like, you know, the whole thing comes crumbling down. But at least if it's this solid, it's going to take them so long to knock it down. And in later stages, it'll be like all reinforced steel too. So... There's just, like, the outside will anyway, but there's just be no way of them taking this thing down, I don't think. But I don't know if this series will go past beyond episode 30. Most of my series end with that first big horde night. I usually don't go until I die, but... I'm getting better at not dying. Alright, 1140 in concrete to cover that section, and we've got 39... Well, sorry... 11.40, so we got enough for one more level. So that's four levels high. That's actually pretty good. Bring this down. So yeah, enough for four levels high to start. I think I want to go up one more from here, though. The encounter we had at that uh, alternate base mission, or uh, episode, um, where the zombies got up on a four block high... Uh, base uh, was a very big eye opener for me. I guess as if they're standing on each other's shoulders, the zombie on top can jump and make it up. Um, they stack each other up. So I want to make sure we're up one higher. Now I, don't, I mean, with this, this is all going to be walled in too, so it's not like they can actually get in. But if we got the concrete and we got the rebar, we might as well do it. Okay, two skill points to spend. 
Man, I tell you, experience goes so fast when you're just building stuff. Like, if you're playing multiplayer and you want to gain experience, be the builder, man. Rebar and concrete upgrades just gives you so much experience. It almost needs to be adjusted, I think. The zombies need to be a bit more experienced again. Just, I mean, I don't know. I like those, the buildings being more full with zombies too. I know some people complained about them not having as many zombies, but I think that should be a uh, option. Now, I don't know if it's like part of the difficulty mode of the number of zombies in buildings, but maybe it is. Well, we've burned through that concrete real fast. All right, we got enough for another 11 more. All right, that's it. Yeah, the iron virus we can put back inside. Okay, so let's go back inside. We might as well head off to the trader again today. And it's only 20 after 7, so let's see if we can go get another mission from the trader. Let's fix a couple of these first. Got another mission from the trader. We'll go off, pull that off today. Come back, buy his steel. Whatever else he's got to offer. Yeah, okay. Let's drop this stuff off in here. And the rebar. Let's throw you there for now. The, actually, we're going to need this for a second because we got more of this coming. No, we don't. Keep that concrete coming. Actually, how's it doing here? Yeah, I'll just let it run. This is done. Let's put another... Get that going. Um, we're good for rebar. Uh, let's get another. Really? Two hundred. We're gonna need some for the drawbridge. So let's do that. Let's put these on. We'll leave these here for now. Uh, we still got our junk turret, which I think is reloaded. Double check on that. Yeah, it was reloaded. Okay, beautiful. Uh, let's grab our bike. I refueled it last night, so we're ready to go. Let's uh, drink some stuff here. Uh, man, we're almost out of food, too. We need a few of these here. Because why not? And then we'll eat a couple of sham. Oh, we got lots of food in us, so we're okay there. So let's just drop these off there. Save the can. Beautiful. Let's get down. Head into the trader. All right, we're here. I shouldn't have to fuel up the bike. I shouldn't have to bring any fuel with me. I think we'll be fine all day long. Howdy. Howdy. How you doing? You got any jobs for me? Uh, clear zombies to the north. Fetch clear to the east. Let's go north. I so we're not dilemma. in the to find hot terrain. And let's guys. go and buy up before I forget, all is forged steel. Oh, what do you have? You don't threat. Oh, we already got that one. Already got that one. You got any steel in here? I don't think you did. It's no. been a real. So pleasure. tomorrow he's gonna restock. She's gonna restock. I keep listening to the voice. All right, let's just put this in here. Bring our junk turret down. And let's get going to the north. Uh, yeah, this way. Now I turned off, uh, in my settings, I turned off motion blur. Um, let me know what you guys think, if this is, if it's cleaner or whatever. It's seeming that it's clearer. It's, um, 
the game seems to be responding a little better, less frame drops. So let me know what you guys think quality wise, if it's any different or not. I mean, if you guys see a difference, great. Um, the thing I don't really, I, I mean, I kind of prefer a motion blur, but if the game runs smoother, I'd rather not go with it. All right, so I think we're going to open up a little bit of this town today. Let's have a look here. Oh, we got most of it open. Let's just go straight north and we'll take this road over. Yeah, so as I was saying about the motion blur, I kind of prefer motion blur. And I think it's just because, you know, I'm so used to watching cameras. Like, you know, even back in like the old film days, 24 frames a second, there's always motion blur. But I mean, video games, you run at 60 frames per second. It's nice and clean and crisp and stuff. And I kind of like that. But I like that to have kind of a motion blur to it. Just my preference. It just kind of smooths out all the edges and stuff. And when you move quickly from one spot to another, it doesn't seem so um, stilted, I guess. It's the only way to I can describe it. All right. So our house that we got to raid is like right over here. So yeah, that's that tower there that I built my base on for that alternate episode. Um, so if you guys encounter this water tower, it's a pretty cool place to build your base on. It's already got a built-in fence with barbed wire on it and, you know. All right, this place. Yeah, okay. Clear the area. And this place has got a basement. So, okay, we got stuff. It's got, it's got, I'm not going to grab extra stuff here. We're just going to go. This is a big place. And I really shouldn't be looking at trash. Let's just grab that, though. All right. Sometimes you get guys up on there. All right, well, I guess we're going up. Start from the top. There's like catacombs under this place. All right. Big bucks, no whammies, guys. Keep your head up, stick on the ice, don't get beat. Okay, is this brass? There's a question for you. Electrical parts. It's fucking iron. Really. Sure. I have a feeling that this is going to break on me. Gotta watch out for birds too. I don't see anybody. Whether that's a good thing or a bad thing, I don't know. It'll certainly make clearing this place quicker. You want us to drop on that bed, do you? Well, doesn't see too bad of an idea. All right. Call clearing house, guys. I'll just wait for you to batter, batter that down. Come on. You're tough. You can do it. Keep hitting it. Keep hitting it. Headbutt it. Do something. Beautiful. Keep hitting. Oh my god.
Just seeing if there's any books we can read real quick. Ooh. I'll take that. That's nice. All right, almost cleared this floor out. I hear somebody walking around outside too. God damn interlopers. All right, nothing here. Well, I guess we could have come in there too. All right, well, no big deal. We're going down. I like how they wait to spawn the zombies until you're on the floor they're on. Yeah, they're coming. I don't know, they could be runners. Nope. That's Big Mama and her son Cletus. Come on Cletus, let's go. Ooh, I missed. Come on, one hit. There we go. Nope, not a runner either. He's dead though. Well, if this this uh, building keeps going this way, that'll be nice. But well, I know there's catacombs under here too, though. So you gotta be wary of that. All right, that's it for that. It's over here. There's some nice stuff we can grab too. Like there's a lot of radiators, brass radiators in this place. Got some food in there. Wonder if I should grab that. Probably. We've only got one bacon and eggs on us. Peas, huh? Okay, so he probably came out of there. Oh. Water, huh? I hear you out there. I should really go out and kill that guy, but can't be bothered. You know, when you see a lot of dead bodies, you gotta reconsider your life. What am I doing down here? Trying to stay alive. Oh, I'll take that. All right, well. What's up, buddy? Ooh, a little too far. Well, still a little too far. Well, that could have been a hell of a lot worse. Where the hell did you come from? Come on, I'm over here. Is that a wandering horde? I bet you it is. Now, I wonder how many assholes are down here. Reload! Oh, we got one guy right there. Oh, he's a runner. Nope, he's not. He just resisted the instant death. Dead now, though. Oh, he's a runner. Where are you going, though? No, he's not a runner. He just moves quickly when he's angry. Wake up! Now I wonder if there's guys coming up behind me here. Sounds like they're awfully close. You know what, I better go deal with this. 
before they show up on me down here. Throwing shot. Good lot of range, huh? Kneecapped. I guess it was just the one. Hey. Alright. Well, that's good news. Now, where was that biker? Oh, there's another... Space over here. Oh, we got another guy outside. Oh, for Christ's sake. It's gonna take all day to clear this place. If you guys keep showing up. Where are you banging? Oh, he's outside. Oh, ammo. Eh. Meh. Now, I don't want to drop down, but I'm going to have to, I think. So, let's get... What the? Oh, double right click. Durr. Shows you how often I use it. Well, yeah, that's not good. Thank God for the junk turret. I knew I shouldn't have dropped down there. All right, excuse that. <laughs> oh, let's use this. How are we doing? Oh, we're okay. Let's reload you. Oh, what's this? Nothing. See ya. I'm hoping that's it. For this section, anyway. Alright, let's grab this loot. I don't hear the zombie banging outside, which is bothering me. Don't need a goddamn paintbrush. We'll, we'll take all that, though. Sure. Ooh, reflex sight, another bow, AK, stuff we can sell. Meh. Well, at least we got our pills back. Now, is there a way to get up there? Is there anything up there? Nothing. Nothing. I guess we got to go around. Okay, nothing. I just don't trust this. Just don't trust it. Okay. Uh, I guess that's it. Oh, return to trader. Yeah, I didn't even look at my uh, 
quest status. That's great. Man, we're like so over full. Uh, do I want to go up there? I probably should, huh? Um, see what's up there. You never know, right? Well, I'm sure you guys know. I don't know. Alright, got a box over here that I need to break into. Okay, that's worth it. Anything down there? Ooh, what's that? Besides all that breaking. Huh, nothing. Alright, we don't need the frames. Actually, let's take it and scrap the... Actually, we do. We gotta get out of here. I was all like, we don't need frames. Wait, what? I can't jump up? Huh. Just scrap these. Jump to it. We should be good. Let's just get the rest of this stuff and get out of here. Now there was a... Hmm. Sure. There was a uh, safe up on the second floor. Nothing here. Except for a bit of free wood. Anything in here? Nothing there. Oop. Aloe vera seeds. Take those. Uh, workbench schematic. We can sell that. I should wrench this workbench, but it's not going to give us anything that we don't already have. We'll take that. Sell it. Yep. Yeah. Glue is always good. Less glue I have to make. Gunpowder is always good. Less gunpowder I have to make. Now, how much of this I want to check? I think we'll just scrap all the tin cans here. More pills. Can't see El Paso no pills is very hard work. Come on, give me a better wrench. I don't want the coffee. Let's just scrap these, but we'll take it. Um, I don't want it, but we'll take it. Oh, I know what we need to do. Uh, let's drop this, because we need to do this. Now, how many of them are down here? Just the one? Uh, I can't check up there. Uh, okay. Cannot pass up the brass. Don't need them coffee beans. Okay, what's in here? Some water. So there's two safes up here, if I'm not mistaken. I should just probably smash this one open. Might be quicker. It's less fun though. I like using the lockpicks. <sighs> Come on, you can do it. Beautiful. Really? Did I just click repair on those? I just clicked repair on those, didn't I? The hell was I thinking? <sighs> Whatever, well, we can sell them. Here's another one of these guys. Beautiful. It's like another 140, uh... No toilet pistols. We got a toilet knife, though. Let's just scrap it.
Okay, this was just nothing. That's not what we need. I thought there was a... I guess there wasn't. Oh, one in here too. So it sounds like she's in the yard. I'm going to go out this window here. Just in case. I hear you out there, girl. Beautiful. Okay, shotgun ammo and a half decent shotgun. Can always make nails, so let's just scrap these. Bring in the shotgun. Alright, let's get out of here. Gonna go out this window. We can actually get up out of this window. There we go. So full of stuff. These guys are still banging on shit out here. Oh, we gotta go to the left. That's Mo. Who else is it gonna be? We are... Oh my god, I went all the way around. <laughs> We're over here. Oh. Not paying attention. Is she inside? Oh, she's in the... Oh, you got up on the roof. Wow. That was really sucky. Okay, now there might be something worthwhile in this bag. I don't know. Well, at least we got our bandage back. It's in here. Well, there's another wrench, but not one that we need. Let's just scrap it. Take that. Oh, I guess I should have checked out the uh, stats on it. Damn it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's make a couple of crossbow bolts out of that. We already checked that trench. Where is it this one we checked? Yeah. I'm going to take the sham sandwiches because we can make uh, sham out of it, I think. Alright, let's head back. Hey, Mo. I think he wanted to hitch a ride with us, but this wasn't too happy. He had to sit on the handlebars, so he just bailed. Popping pills. We're going to have to come back here. Alright, so I'm going to hold off going to the trader till tomorrow. We have to go there anyway. He's going to re be restocking tomorrow. So we want to see if we can pick up some more steel. Now, I think I'm full, right? Yeah. So let's go take this stuff upstairs. Alright, let's empty, empty this stuff out. We're going to hang on to this because we're going to plant it. Uh, you can go in there. Um, you still will hang on to. You can go in there. Um, bottle of water. Okay, red tea. Got some more meat stew, which is really nice. Uh, I'm not seeing... Oh, water bottles. All right, uh, electrical parts. What else do we have here? Oil, plastic, glue, tape. We got somebody outside. It's a horde. Screw it, let's go get them. Come on, you jerks. Don't wreck on my house. Yeah, you heard me over here, didn't you? Good night. One shot wonder. Alright, let's pick this up. Might as well be encumbered when we're fighting these guys because, you know, that's how I roll. 
Oof. I just knock your girlfriend out, Mo. Knock your ass out too. God, I love this bat. Come on, stamina regen. Here we go. Ooh, see ya. Three more. Oh, I missed. Ooh. Out of stamina. Not quite a one-hit wonder. Well, two hits will take it. Oh my god, really? Ah, there we go. And this guy's decided he's not coming in for any of this. He's like, now nah, that guy's taking people's heads off. I'm just going to stay over here. Knock your ass out. See ya. Alright, let's take our shiz inside. Uh, we got a couple of hours. Let's drop some stuff off. Um, what should we do? I should probably go get some oil shale. I can probably do that right now. Eh. Yeah, I probably should. Actually, I can't make oil, but I will be able to once we use... Where did I put the bike? There it is. Once I... I um, spend a point in uh, uh, one of the tech skills. Not advanced engineering, but uh, I can't remember what it's called. We'll be able to make oil. Chemistry. Is it chemistry? Advanced chemistry? Something like that? <sighs> it's been quite a while since I've played. Alright. Uh, let's get down here. There should be... Uh, hopefully we can find some oil shell like right in here somewhere. This is where our mine is, so... It's relatively, um... Oh, I remember now. There was a spot right over here. Right? Yeah. Oh, this is, um... Nitrate. Oh, there we go. Right there. Beautiful. Ooh, level 33. I used to pry... Well, not pry myself, but I used to try and get two levels a day in the last alpha build. I find it very difficult to do that now. You can if you're actually building stuff. But if you're just out doing a questing and a, just killing zombies and stuff, it can be difficult to do that. At least I find it difficult. I mean, I could be wrong. Other players could find it, you know, easy to do. But with the decreased experience and the decreased number of zombies, it's a little more difficult. All right. Clear some of this up. Well, still giving us a way out. All right, we'll come back at another time and finish this up. I'll have to spend a whole episode digging stuff up again. Oh, we got another Mo here. What's up, buddy? Ooh, beautiful. Let's finish you off. Can't have you wandering around town. Go away. Alright, we're down to half a tank of gas now. I think we got around a thousand gas left. In the house. Somewhere around there. Okay, let's get this closed. Get up here. All right, so we want to get a couple things moving here. We're going to need springs, uh, which are over here. I got to really move. Once this is gone, it's going to make things so much easier in this place. Okay, we got 73 springs. Plenty, beautiful. So we need those. Uh, what else are we dropping in here? Um, oil shale for now. The rest of this stuff is pretty much going elsewhere. What about... Uh, no, we got Medicaid here. Yeah, we got so many of these. I should just sell stacks of these. How much are they worth? 176? Yeah. 
Eh. All right. Uh, we should put these three in here. Actually, let's bring ten of them out because I want to get them started here. So each one of these is worth a hundred. So one, two, three, four, five. So there's a thousand right there. Um, what's going in here? This is going in here. Yeah, that's it. And in here. Got a lot of gack. That's got to get planted. I can put this in here for now. I should just dump most of this stuff in here for now. Uh, nope. Uh, you need to go with the ammo. Let's just drop these guys in there. You can go in there. And then here. Okay. Starting to get there in ammo. We got 600, 771 at uh, 762 rounds, which is good. Uh, we still got tons of uh, 9mm. Alright, so we need springs, forged iron, and what was the other thing to make doors? Uh, bolt doors. We need three of these guys, so mechanical parts. So let's get three of these guys moving. Let's get three moving. Um, yeah, we're going to need to hold on to that other forged steel. Actually, I should probably see... Let's plant this first. Having aloe vera is nice. We can start making bandage, bandages soon enough. Let's get that planted. Um, this we ended, right? No, it ran out of, uh, really? Ran out, huh? Uh, let's get you. Let's get the mix going. Starting to slow down here with the amount of concrete we've got. Um, to spend a few more days making some more. Okay, um, we're going to check real quick. Water purifier, storage pockets, scope, rad remover. We want to do that. Uh, five glue, five mechanical parts, and ten springs. So let's go ahead and do that. I wonder if I should do a couple. I think I should probably do a couple. I need ten glue. Uh, ten of these. Oops, not 11, but 10. You should be able to, like, use your mouse wheel and scroll and put these in your inventory, up and down, in and out. That would make things a lot easier. Um, 20, and we need 10 of these. Let's make a couple of rad removers so we can have them for our guns. Beautiful. That's really going to help us out on Horde Night. Um, if we can find some better weapons like better pistol and stuff like that. Um, I definitely want to have those on pretty much everything. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to leave the episode there, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can drop any comments in the comment section uh, down below. Tomorrow we'll hit the trader, uh, get another mission probably, um, and get a lot more concrete moving. We're going to have to melt a lot more of this, I think. Um, get it started anyway um, so we can get our horde base finished now yeah we'll, we can talk about that in the next episode all right so i'm gonna leave it there hope you enjoyed it i'll see you next time